Hi everyone, Omeza here again. I brought this very particular dynamic and highly interactive dashboard to you again right here in Exo. So right now, if I actually click on this particular false background, what I'm going to see is the background to be changed automatically to this particular color. So right now, I really want to actually choose this background and this is what I have. I have a very dynamic background right here on this dashboard I can actually switch to to make our work more stand out. Now what about this background? Awesome, right? And then what about this? Now this is a very awesome feature we added to our Excel dashboard. I'm gonna make it some kind of more interactive and user friendly. And our boss is gonna love this, right? So let me show you and the cool feature I added to this dashboard is gonna make it very very more you know entertaining if you wanna actually go on it. So right now I have this slide in and out particular, you know, our menu right here. I can actually click and see more about what you really have right here. We can use this feature to hide anything you want to hide and all of that. So right now if I click on middle worst and all I'm going to say is the whole dashboard gets to like filter all together. Now if I want to actually remove my filter, I'm going to click on this and if I want to take this away, what I'm going to do, I'm going to click back on this and it's going to hide away. And once I actually move my cursor out of it, it's going to hide automatically. This is a very good feature you might really want to learn how to create. What about this very particular chart right here, which we don't really have existing in Excel. It's a custom feature we have right on this particular dashboard right now. I just want to say my shout out to PK. PK is an awesome Excel uh, dashboard creator on YouTube from India. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say my shout out to you guys. PK, thank you very much for this visual. I'm going to teach you how to actually implement this on your dashboard. I know what, I've, what it is. Every single time you create a dashboard, is a PV table sometimes we really need to actually uh, want to use a particular feature that PV table is going to actually make us not to be used because of the kind of data set we have but we can still manipulate it to actually give us that so let us see what the dashboard is all about right here so immediately I have this click this takes everything out of focus and this is awesome right I'm gonna teach you how to do all this oh rem that reminds me you have this dashboard actually to be downloaded to your computer and actually take a look at how this actually works i'm gonna actually give you the opportunity to actually get it downloaded free download you're gonna download it and actually you can follow along to create this step by step so right now it's all about crime analysis now this is survey used to get the opinion of people across various cities in the united states on the increase of crime now the question is this, between maladministration, which is bad government, and the internet, which one do you think increases crime in our current society across the world? Now we have gathered the simple, sorry, we have gathered the sample data from various age groups, gender, and demographic. So we are to analyze the data collected to evaluate the weight of crime between maladministration and the era of the internet so now what i see how many people are of the opinion of the uh that the bad government is really the cause of the increment of what of the increment of crime in our society and how many people are really of the opinion that it is, was the internet that is actually the cause so right now if we come right here what we're gonna see we're gonna see the results so now the result we actually should recognize the result of bad government and in overall result what we actually have right here is we have the internet and we have the bad government so we have 43.0% of people that is of the opinion that the internet is actually the cause of the increment of the bad government and actually right here we have 57.0% of people who is actually of the opinion that the government which is the bad government we have in our society today or the politician wherever are the cause of the increment of crime and all of that and the difference between these two percentages is actually 13% difference in the kind of view we really get it right so what about this you might really want to know how to create this right that is cool all you just gotta do is to hit the subscribe button and follow me step by step as we create it from the scratch from the uh, team switched down to the menu right here we have so we're gonna create everything I mean if I talk about creating everything we're gonna create everything from the scratch this is how we do it on this particular channel we don't just show highlight or overview of dashboard so we give you the overview and we show you how to create that so we have this data set right here to help us with that is is that data set is 300,000 uh, so we're right here so now we're going to be using the data set to actually get it created so we have it analyzed and we get it visualized right here which is going to actually help our boss or our client out 
So let's say you're in the college or in the university and you're a student of data and you're given this particular awesome uh, dashboard to go create and you have something like this. What are you going to have? You're going to have an A, right? That is exactly what we want to have right here. So have it downloaded to your computer and let's see how we can practice and get it just like what it is right here, right now. So I have you in mind creating this dashboard and I believe you would like to stay tuned to actually help me create this from the scratch. So hit the subscribe button right now and click on any of the card right here to actually start learning from the bottom. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next tutorial.